This is the Mountain Equipment Makalu jacket. Mountain Equipment have been making shells for years now and have been always one of our best sellers over the last 37 years of outside. Now the Makalu has been in the range for a while but this is the latest iteration using three layer Gore-Tex and it's brought back to market in a really lovely way with a much more ethical standpoint. So one of the really, really good things about this jacket is its price. Now don't get me wrong, it's not cheap. That's not the right word. Nothing using Gore-Tex is cheap because it's really good stuff. But compared to a lot of things in the market, you get a lot of jacket for your money with this. So I would say this jacket is based at the outdoor enthusiast, if you will. Perfect on a day like today. It's wet, it's cold, it's a bit grim. We're not high mountaineering in this. It is being used a lot in pretty grim weather. The Makalu uses three layer Gore-Tex. So it's not Gore-Pro, which is at the top of the tree. If you want this sort of layout, but with the Gore-Tex Pro, which gives you lighter and more breathable, it costs a lot more, but you would go and look at the Lotsi jacket, which is ever classic for mountain equipment. However, you get the same feature set with the Makalu at a lower price and actually maybe a little bit softer feel as well. The Makalu uses three layer Gore-Tex, that's the new EPE Gore-Tex, which is basically PFAS and PFC free. So all those forever chemicals that are bad for the environment, there's none of that in this jacket. What is amazing about the Makalu is how featured it is. It's got sort of everything you need for the UK hill walking. The really good big chest pocket, which we like getting a map in, us in the UK. Nice pit zip for venting if you do overheat. Good hand pockets for when you're walking along and the rain's really battering and your hands are cold. Like I say, this is not a mountaineering jacket. You are not wearing harness and climbing. You could do that, but that's not what it's designed for. It's got the classic, really great protective hood for mountain equipment that can cinch down nice and tight for when it's really blowing hard. A feature a lot of people like is the two-way zip as well. It's a big chunky zip, not one of these super lightweight ones that might break. Two-way zip, nice and chunky, it's gonna last. This is not a super light jacket. We are not pushing the boundaries of what can be done in the mountains. This is gonna last you. So I mentioned this is a three-layer jacket. If you don't really know what I mean by that, it has a backer. A lot of the time, these jackets, they'll obviously have a face fabric and then a membrane, but to save weight or cost, they might not have a backer, which means they get a bit clammy and sweaty, and you can see they're not gonna be as durable. This has a nice woven backer on there, which helps take moisture away from the body, makes it feel a bit more comfortable, and adds a quite a lot of durability, and it's got that throughout. And actually, while peeking inside there, I nearly forgot to mention the little inside zip pocket, which everyone really likes. Great for keeping your phone in there, like a bit away from the elements. With all waterproofs and outdoor gear, we need to look after them and care for them. That means washing and reproofing. Now you do that with any waterproof in the market. However, when you take away the PFAS or the PFCs, the, these forever chemicals, it does mean that you might need to do it a little bit more than the other ones. However, it's a little price to pay for looking after the environment a little bit better. So all in all, the Makalu is a well-featured, robust, long-lasting, all-round waterproof. They'll do a good job for many things on the hill.